Hi everyone, my name is Manisha and welcome back to my channel. So today's reading is for Cancer Sun Sign and for the month June 2022. Uh, I have already drawn the cards for you, so let's see what kind of energy you will be having in this month. So for the starting of the month, I got two cards over here. Let me show you them. Okay, so for the starting of the month, okay, so it looks like, you know, uh, there is someone in your life, uh, this person is uh, older than you. This person in a, is in a position where this person can actually give you a lot of incentives or a lot of benefits. For a lot of people, definitely this is related to their workplace. But just in case if you're not working, this is related to your home environment. But yes, I can see a person who is older than you, a person who's in the authority, this person is actually judging you. Whatever you are doing, whatever uh, work you are doing, in whichever direction you're putting your energy, this person is, you know, uh, making a point of everything that you are doing. Maybe you have joined somewhere uh, new and your boss is, uh, you know, trying to analyze what exactly you are. Or if there is anywhere that you're working, your boss, definitely is somehow keeping an eye on you so make sure make sure whatever you are doing it should be legal it should be uh, I would say correct because what I can see is that they are very much concerned about how you're taking decisions they are very much concerned about you know how fair you're keeping your decisions in your life and this is very important for them this is very important maybe uh, for you or maybe you know for some uh, they think that you know uh, it's important to do the work but how fair or how uh, nicely you're doing it it doesn't matter but for them it's it matters a lot for them f being fair matters a lot so show them that yes, you are very much fair in your work. Show them that yes, you are very honest in your work and then definitely they will like you. Or just in case, if you are in a situation where you wanted to impress someone, if you wanted to impress someone who's older than you, then also this is one of the trick. Show them how uh, concerned and ca uh, caring you are, how, how much honest honesty you put in your work so all these things all these you know uh, character values they they give a lot of importance to these things so just keep this in your mind you know uh, yeah so then let's move to the middle of the month and for that i got this card well starting of the month definitely as i said if you are not working definitely this is happening in your uh home life or i would say in a relationship where there is someone around you who's older than you especially he's, he's kind of a father figure and uh, uh, just in case if you wanted to impress this person this person is very strict this person is very strict in, in terms of you know behavior and everything but yes you can conquer them you can conquer them through love definitely then comes the middle of the month and for that I got the judgment card. See, I was talking about, you know, someone judging you and here's the judgment card. Judgment is here. Okay. It looks like a uh, cancer that whosoever is judging you, they're gonna uh, pass on the result in your favor. This card is a card of, yes, this card is a card of, uh, you know, having results in your favor. Definitely. So it's a good thing, uh, it's a good result of your first week, but only if you are doing this, if you're keeping your work fair, if you're keeping your work honest, then definitely you're about to reach this place where the judgment will be in your favor. Uh, in the middle of the week also, I can see that if from the past few weeks or months, in whichever direction you're putting your hard work in definitely I can see that you have you had faced a lot of problems you have gone through a lot but now is the time when you will be able to receive the decision 
and the decision is will solely uh, depend on how much hard work you were putting how much honest you were in your work or in your relationship definitely then comes the end of the month and for that i got three cards actually let me show you them okay so in the end of the month Cancer in the end of the month, you have to be little careful about your deeds, about your work. Uh, what I can see is that and what I can feel through these cards is that uh, things are favoring you. Results are coming into your favor. Things are falling into place. But somehow, what I can see is that just because everything is falling into place, maybe you will stop working hard. Maybe this will this thing will it come into your mind that okay everything is working now now do, i don't have to put in that much efforts but here what i can see is that your situation still demand you to be on your toes it still demands you to work hard this is not the time when you should get the result and you should just relax that okay fine i'm done or i have done enough don't keep such things in your mind that you have done enough even if you're getting the positive results because in future if you want to continue if you want to have such success in your life continuously then you have to keep working on your skills you just can't stop you just cannot this is this is just the first step of towards your success this is not the just a success right so to achieve your dreams you have to keep continuing your hard work Secondly, again, uh, the reason why you have to work hard at this point of time, even, even after working so hard from past few months, even after getting the good results, because what I can see here is that there are a lot of people around you who want themselves to be in your position. They are jealous somehow. They want to, you know, cut your edges down. They want to take your place. And yeah. A lot of competition I can see wherever you are. A lot of people who who somehow admire you, but they are je they are jealous of you as well. So just keep this thing in your mind that the competition is not over. They are still working to cut your edges. They are still working to grab your position. Okay, so you have to be very vigilant. And secondly. The thing is, you are full of resources, Cancer. You are full of everything that you need to conquer these people. But the thing is, you don't have to fight with them. If you keep this thing in your mind that, okay, I'm having so many competitions. I have to work better than them or I have to, you know, uh, be in competition with them then i guess you won't be able to conquer them the only way you can conquer them is actually to prove in front of them that you are someone who's very trustworthy you are someone who's very honest you are someone on whom they can actually trust you are their well-wisher not a competition right and this is the way you can go ahead in your position in your situation or in your company i can see you have to collect them you have to you know uh, unite them they all are segregated they all have their own opinions about you they all are thinking in a very different way about you you have to show them how uh, caring and concerned you are about them how much you care about your employees how much you care about the people who work around you you don't consider consider them as a competition you consider them as your friends so keeping these thoughts in your mind when you give such kind of vibe to other people that yes you consider them as a friend rather than a competition they will definitely admire you and they will definitely start st supporting you i am not saying that you know uh, stop working hard or stop doing uh, good things in your uh, work life or in your day to day life you definitely have to keep working hard you definitely have to uh, you know keep sharpening your uh, knife but along with this working on your skills working on your own 
uh, lifestyle and everything still side by side tell them show them that you consider them as your friend companion rather than as a you know competitor if you give that kind of feel they will realize it and they will start supporting you because what i can see is that in your work area area especially you need support of other people because one person cannot handle the everything they cannot handle everything okay so to get to gather the support of your uh, companions the, uh, to gather the support of your colleagues you have to show them that yes you are a trustworthy person so this is one small trick that you can use to actually gain their trust so yeah that's all from my side for the month of june thank you so much have a nice day bye bye